today the lord gives this wonderful promise book of genesis chapter 50 verse 20 we have a god who is able to transform everything negative happened in our life and caused to happen by our enemies for our favor all of you read together today's promise word genesis 50:20 Even, even though, though even though you intended to do you intended a to harm to me a harm to me god intended it god intended to for do it good for good in order to preserve in order to preserve a numerous people a numerous people as he is doing today as he is doing today this is the words of joseph in the old testament he was in the barren well because they plotted against him so there are people who are looking to jesus the people who are standing against them they have already devised already invented many weapons against you to destroy you genesis chapter 37 was 19 they called him dreamer not their own brother there are people who are insulting you when you pray a prayer warrior a logosian sitting and praying every day 3 o'clock what all these things why do you have uh, brought home and what are you doing it so they criticized joseph and his prayer life and spiritual life and they called him a dreamer and the verse 20 let us kill him and throw him out and finish his life so there are people around you like blood sucking wolves they are clothed with the lamb skin but inside they are venomous wolves there are people like that but fear not seeing all these elements in around you we have a god to translate and transform all these events and things for our favor so they plotted against him and verse 22 they put him in the well they put him in the barren well so he was in a barren well and uh, was 24 he just sold out they cast him out from the house from the father's house from the father's property and also they just put him out of the country put him out of the country so he was a foreigner such kind of things happened in the life of joseph but god turned that also for his favor then we have seen the one who was in the barren well where is sitting now genesis 41 41 this is going to happen in your life this is god's own work genesis 41 41 he is sitting next to pharaoh the emperor and having the all power and authority in egypt not by click not by politics not by power gimmicks but he is just enthroned on the royal throne by god's power hallelujah hallelujah see i have set you over all the land of egypt he was in the barren well they plotted against him this is your story my brother and sister this is your own story but the lord is there to transform everything for you our favor nothing is bad in our life everything bad happened we have a good god to transform it for our favor hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank, you, thank you jesus praise you jesus praise you jesus thank you lord thank you lord praise you jesus praise you and jesus. joseph said genesis chapter 41 verse 16 pharaoh this is not my power then by whose power he is on the royal throne now is the power of god god has given him talents god has given him charisms so we attend daily the retreat every day we are getting our talents are multiplied numerous are our talents and it will be multiplied and if it is possessed by devil and demons it must be released and also god's own power and charisms given to us that's why every day we preach from this pulpit we want to see you 
power filled people not powerless powerful people hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank you jesus and uh, joseph said genesis 41:16 pharaoh my lord said this is not my power it is not i but god will give you pharaoh a favorable answer he explained the dreams of pharaoh god's own power power of vision power of dream power of interpretation we all are in need of charismatic gifts because of his charismatic gifts manifestation gifts that's a wonderful wonderful god's gift to evangelize or to save the people to heal the people to transform them we need manifestation gifts joseph had it because of that the one who was intended in the barren well and bitten by poisonous snake and eaten by scorpions they were all thinking like that or by ants and worms will eat up his body and we will fabricate a story that one tiger killed him and destroyed him or a lion destroyed him such kind of things happen in your life god is alive jesus is alive to save you and bless you and put you on the royal throne amen amen 